Hey y'all. Okay, so today I thought that I would show y'all a page setup in my personal journal. I've been trying to work in this a little bit more because I need to get uh, this journal set up a little more so that I can start getting my pictures put in there. So I need to start doing some page uh, setups and, and layouts in here. I've already started collecting some of my photos that I wanna put in here but I need to get the pages actually set up in order to get, um, get my photos in there. So I was thinking that I could do maybe, let's see, I'm not sure. This is gonna be my mom's page here. She collects elephants, she loves elephants. And I had this piece of, uh, sorry, so it was perfect and then i also found this little um i guess it's it's not really a poem but i'm not sure what it's actually called but it's like a quote yeah it'd be like a quote but this quote makes me think of my mom this is this is something she would totally uh send me and there's a picture of my mom and then a picture of me and my mom at christmas so I'm gonna do some kind of little setup on that page with that too. I'm not sure what page I wanna to do today. I did start with trying to do something with this. So maybe, maybe I can finish this. How do I want that? I think I'm gonna put it like this on this back page. And I, I did go through my bag of sorry and I found this little strip and I glued that down to just, I have just some regular, uh, like regular, like lacy fabric. And I thought it would be cute to add on here as like a little topper because I know that I want this to flip up. I don't want to glue this all the way down. So I'm thinking of um, gluing this down right here. So this can be a little flip up and it gives it more of a finished look instead of just gluing it down like that. It gives it more of a, like a finished. So I think I might do something like that. I have so many blank pages in here. I, have, I really haven't done anything besides just put this together and then I got so distracted with so many other projects. So. Let's see, if I glue this down, I can still add, because I wanna put a little corner pocket, but I wanna kind of build that up, like with some layers. So, hmm. I think though I'm just gonna start with the blank page first. And I do have a printout. I have one of these little pages here that has, uh, it's like, has some lines on it. It's really faint, but, um, I'm not sure if it shows up that good on the camera, but I can see it really good. So, I was gonna lay a piece of that down, and I like the way the, the flowers, it's like a muted, um, it's like a muted picture. I like that. So, what I'm gonna do is rip this off just slightly like that and then i can put this down and i'm also going to make this a side uh like a side pocket right here so what i'm going to do i'm just going to start gluing this down that's what works best for me i've said that before in other videos that if I just glue it, like get it and glue it down, then um, I'll end up liking it. The more I think about it, then the less I end up liking it. So I'm gonna just put that down. So I just glued these three sides right here. And that left that open right there. Let me get a little piece of scrap paper here. So I can put a lot of stuff in that little side part right there. Actually, this is a cute little strip right here. 
I can put that right there at the top. Is that, yeah, that'll work there. And I'm gonna glue the whole piece down. And it has some overhang on this page, like at the end right here, but I like that, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna try to even that up. By the time I'm done with this book, there'll be all kinds of stuff poking out all over it. So that's fine with me. And I pulled out a bunch of random pieces here too. So I can see if I wanna work with any of this. Oh, you know what I want to do? I want to put a belly band on here. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put a belly band on here. Um, Should I? Oh, I didn't bring my little paper punch over here. I would have liked to have paper punched that. I think that would have been cute. I didn't bring it over here. So, I think... Okay, so I think what I'm going to do, oops, I'm going to just glue this side down right here first, like that. Glue that down. So this is going to be a belly band, but it didn't block this uh, side pocket either. I didn't glue that all the way down. So I have a little belly band there, but I want to add some texture and some layers. Don't want to use a blue. I don't know if I want to use that blue. Um, oh, I don't want to use those same scraps. I need need something oh maybe I can maybe I can do it like this I don't have a bigger piece so I'll just use those two like that I can layer that a little bit needs to come down a little more. It's a little thick right there in the middle. Okay, so that could go like that. That can go like that. Um, we can throw one of these butterflies on there. Oh, this one's a really pretty one. Put a little butterfly on there. I have this little clip, too, that I put some of these little, they're like little glass beads. And they just barely fit on that bulb pen. Uh, let's see. Oh, maybe I could put these on the bulb pen. I wonder if that'll work. Okay, I think I'm going to try something. I don't know if that's going to work or not, but we're going to try. So what I'm going to do is make a little, like build a little thing here to go on this pen. I can make a little tag thing, like a little hangy tag. That would be cute. I'm gonna try it and see what it looks like. I may not like it, but we'll see. I need a pokey. Let me see, get my pokey tool. I need, you know what, I'm gonna just use my, my lace. 
I need to stab through all of those. I might have went too far down. Oh, I need to go the other way. I don't know if it's going to work with the beads on there. Oh, that might work. That might look cute. Or maybe I should have put it on the other side of the beads. Uh, let me see. Maybe I can turn them around. So that way I can see the beads and that won't, the papers won't be covering them up. Oh, I, I think I like that. That'll look really cute. And I can clip this bulb pin onto some of that fabric right there. Hmm. Okay. I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna do it. I will need some of this glue. But I don't want to mess with my belly band, so I need to do these all in layers. And they'll have to, like, I'm going to have to build that layer so they can all stack, like, on each other. So that way it's, um... It's not messing with my belly band that I made. This might be like too much, but I think it looks really pretty. So I think that it's gonna work. And you can also, um, Take this to your sewing machine and sew it. You don't have to glue it if you don't want to. I tried to to do a lot more with uh, like gluing my stuff down instead of sewing because I've had um, I've had more comments from uh, from everyone saying that they don't really sew. So that's why I changed up a lot of my stuff. And I, I just do a lot more like of gluing. So my belly band is still good. Okay. And I can put that right there. Let's see, I just need this part, middle part so it won't go over. So that will be like that. Getting glue all over me again. And then before I get too much here, I need to try to get this pin on there. Uh, where do I want it though? Hmm. Trying to see where I want it. May oh, maybe on the end here. Because then it can also uh, work as like a, a, a tab thing. Like a flippy. Oh. Oh, yeah. I like that. So whenever the, uh, whenever my journal is open and closing, this will hang out. Okay, I'm going to put the little butterfly here. And I still need a little something. 
over here though. That's too big. I need something. See if that'll work. Oh yeah, I like that. That looks cute. Okay. And then I can make like a like a, a little journal book. One of the little flippy books to go in it. Yeah, that still works. So I can make one of my little flippy books to go in there. Or, let me see, I have this little envelope that I was gonna make a little journal, like a little mini journal envelope. So I can put some notes and stuff. That's too little, but just for now. So I need to make like a tall, I want a taller one, but I don't have the stuff over here. Oh, that would be a, a good um, cover if it was tall enough. I don't have any of the stuff to do it over here. Okay, so then, I thought something was pulling that down. So I need to make a little um, a little journal book to go in here so I can do some journaling. And I need to give that a little bit of, a little bit of ink. That is so cute. I like that. You know what? For right now, what I can do is just put this paper in there. So that will remind me to come back and make a little journal book for that. that. I love this little tag, that is so cute. Okay, so there's one page set up. So, oh, I gotta make a side thing too. Oh, I almost forgot about that. So, I'm going to stick something in there so I don't forget about that also. So I need to make something for that one and that one. And then for this one, I think what I'm gonna do is glue this down. Cause like I said earlier, I can, I can still, I can flip this up and still work on this page and still build on it. Um, but I do need to get this piece you know, like put down somewhere. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm just gonna put a strip right here at the top. And lay that down. This is such a pretty piece. I just love this little piece. And then also I'm gonna put another strip. Well, you know what, I need to size it first. Um, let's see, I need to cut it down a little bit. So, cut that off right there. Oh, cut that off right there. And cut this little piece right here. And then I'm gonna put a strip of glue on the back side of this one here. Just like that.
and that'll hold that down like that. And I can still, um, I can still work on this page because I want to add a lot more to that. So, so pretty. It's like so elegant. I love that. Okay, so that's all I'm going to do for this video. Um, I'm trying to keep my videos shorter so that they're not, you know, dragging on and on. So that's all I'm going to do for this one. Um, if you like this idea of just doing some random pages in here just to give you some page ideas, um, then give me a thumbs up and let me know in the comments that, that you would like to see more of this. And until next time, I'll see ya. Bye.